From his Central Texas Command Center, deep behind enemy lines, the information war continues. It's Alex Jones and the GCN Radio Network. Okay, uh, l- let's take some phone calls, and then next hour I'm going to really detail all this. In fact, let me go ahead and dig up the phone numbers to YouTube. Um, I meant to test these last night, but I didn't get around to it, so I'm going to have the guys... I'm going to have the guys test it. Um, guys, come in here. Here's the numbers. Uh, where did you? Oh, yeah, that's the Pittsburgh Post-Gazette. Print that for me. Yeah, the Pittsburgh Post-Gazette is 412-263-1890. And, 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 and tell the Pittsburgh Post-Gazette, you know, uh, here's the numbers, folks. Let me just give you these. Yeah, go ahead and double-check those numbers right there and then, and then, and then put that up on screen. Okay, that's, that, that's Google in the Bay Area. Okay, YouTube, Google, whatever you want to call it. That's the YouTube campus itself. Anyways, um, imagine what they've already done to us. They already, within hours of the ma- uh, of the cops being killed, had the Southern Poverty Law Center that's involved with the ADL at YouTube running things. It's all interconnected. That, that's been admitted, censoring. They already had the white supremacist shoot some poor cops. So he's throwing a fit because his dog was urinating on the ground and mommy told him to get out. Turned out the guy was attacking me on my comment page. They take it, the Southern Poverty Law Center feeds it, my name out of hundreds of sites he admittedly had visited, to the paper, implies I'm the reason he killed the cops. That's not enough, Pittsburgh Post-Gazette. I show the article and say on air that it's uh, uh, a libel, and you bastards, that isn't enough for you. you got to go file a fake copyright claim. I mean, even in some twisted universe, you could claim we couldn't show articles on air, which is pure bull under fair use, and everybody does it. You know, C-SPAN, uh, the, the uh, in the papers, show on news in, in New York, everybody does it. You know, 60 Minutes shows clips of articles. They're not getting rights to that, it's news. Even in a twisted world, if that was okay, you bastards implied that I basically did the, cause the killing. I mean, your, your hardcore assault on me, working with a private group with the police within hours to attack me, I'm the number one target? After cops are killed, within hours, this is up? Within hours, the same afternoon, the same day? And then that isn't enough? Then you want to shut down my free speech because it was an audio of me uh, criticizing them on the Sunday show, showing their article. I mean, it's not enough for you? You got to ban my speech, you bastards? What is your problem? Are you just demanding to be sued by me? I mean, is this just an absolute obsession of yours? You know, we already uh, had, by, by pointing out it was a fraud, uh, Raw Story, Daily Cost, and several other papers did retract. The, the uh, Pittsburgh Post-Gazette wrote two articles saying, okay, the white supremacists didn't like Alex. But they never retracted the original story. They just kind of halfway did it. And I talked to the reporter. And he just said, well, I was fed this by the Southern Poverty Law Center. And then they're in the article. I mean, you know, the Southern Poverty Law Center, I know you don't like it that I get up here with the FBI secret memos and then we get it to the newspapers and it's in the Rocky Mountain News and it was in the AP and it was in the, um, what's the paper in uh, Salt Lake City, Salt Lake City Tribune. I know it makes you mad it came out that we exposed that you were running the white supremacist operation at Elohim City with Tim McVeigh, with Andre Strassmeyer. I know that's upsetting for you, Southern Poverty Law Center. I understand. <laughs> And you know what? It blew up in your face trying to imply I had the cops killed. People found out about you, didn't they? So we'll just continue to make lemonade out of these lemons you throw at us. You make me sick, though. You make me sick what you did. You make me want to throw up what you did at Elohim City, running that operation, having your people at the top of it. You're disgusting. Sickening filth. They literally peddle all this racism and and manipulate and control a lot of these groups it's been documented many times so that they can demonize free speech in America and do what they're doing to us now and openly ban free speech. You are disgusting. You make me sick. Do you guys call that number? That is uh, Google's number. Okay. You know what? I'm going to give it out next hour. Start your engines, ladies and gentlemen. Start your engines. Get ready. And I want you to call them and be polite and tell them you're going to boycott their sponsors. You're going to take Google ads off your website. If you've got websites out there, a bunch of crap anyways, 
I, I took it off a year ago because I found out how evil Google was. And, yeah, it was a financial hit for us, but, you know, whatever. By the way, we need to be financially supported. Folks, I put up our emergency broadcast off our prisonplanet.tv servers in high quality a week and a half ago. And last time I checked, it was 20-plus thousand downloads and over a couple thousand bucks. How much was it? The point is I put up another video, one of the ones they censored, uh, where I broke down how it was a hoax. And uh, that's costing me a lot of money right now. It's up on Infowars.com. People are like, well, just show all your videos for free. I have to explain how reality works. Number one, we used to have two servers for PrisonPlanet.tv members, and at peak times every day it would get slow. Then I added CDNs, two CDNs. Well, one of them's got 75 terabytes a month. The other's got 30. We're starting to max those out. I don't even want to tell you how much it costs. I don't know. What is it? 20-something grand now just for those a month. The money's got to come from somewhere. That's why you hear the sponsors and the gold pitching and the water filter pitching. And I only push stuff I believe in anyways. But the point is, i got to spend a lot of my time trying to fork money in here to throw it into the engine. I need fuel. I need you to load bombs on my airframe. I can go in there and bomb the enemy in the info war. I'm a big old stratofortress. I go in every day and bomb the enemy. But I need I need the bombs. I need the fuel. And it isn't easy, and these crazy people keep emailing me going, you should just have your own YouTube and give it out for free. Do you have any idea how much that would cost? Do you have any idea? I'm not some miser. That's why we've been so successful. Most people would make money in something like this and immediately stick it in their pocket. Not Alex Jones. 95% of the money comes into this operation, goes right back into the guns, right back into the info war weapons, right back into shooting salvos of truth downrange. I got a little fun in case I get sued to defend myself. Got a fund for litigation as people that you know go after us. And got a little bit of fun to run a few months of operation costs. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's what matters to me is ideas. That is the currency I'm into is beating these people. I want to win. I want the truth to come out. And I told you we've entered the maximum danger zone. We are now going mega viral everywhere. We're being hacked, attacked demonized, slandered, lied about, hit by COINTELPRO from every angle because we are exploding on every front, ladies and gentlemen. We are bringing in a mighty harvest of people waking up. So get a PrisonPlanet.tv membership, five ninety five dollars a month. Get a yearly membership, you get three months free. PrisonPlanet.tv. Get a membership just to protest YouTube. And I'll put, if we get enough money coming in, or maybe we can have donor memberships or like 20 bucks a month if you want to, contribute to free videos because i don't have the money i mean we, we, you want donors you know i've gotten donations before and had contests you know and, and giving people prize money with the money because that's all i spend it on you want to buy the books buy the videos buy the materials at infowars.com you want to mail us donations yeah you give me thousand dollars that's about depending on how long the video is that's about i don't know twenty thousand people on a medium-sized video I mean, you know, it, it costs money to send out this data. So please donate. Alex Jones, 3001 South Lamar, Suite 100, Austin, Texas, 78704. We need the fuel.